hi guys welcome to my youtube channel today in this video i am gonna talk about the reinforcement placement and casting of concrete into the box culvert which is connected with the drainage so in order to understand this video don't forget to watch it completely also press on the bell icon so that you do not miss any latest updates from my channel here you can see that the iron benders are placing the reinforcement bars. The concrete culvert had been constructed in two parts as you can see. Half part had been completed so that the vehicles can pass over. Now the other part of the culvert is being constructed. As such you can see the reinforcement bars have been placed. Y10 are the full length while Y12 are the runners. The spacing has been kept at 15 cm center to center. The iron benders are connecting these reinforcement bars with the help of bending wire. This culvert is not exactly straight. Skew had been done so that the water can pass through. It had been done because of the flow of water. You may also see that this box culvert is connected together with the drainage here we are casting concrete into the drainage the width is 1.4 meters the length of this drainage is 27 meters the culvert length is almost 16.2 meters you can see that concrete has been casted with the help of transit mixer this transit mixer has a total capacity of 8 cubic meters You may see that wooden planks had been placed while we were casting concrete into the base of this drainage. Here as well when we were casting concrete into the base of culvert we had placed the wooden planks. It is good to place these wooden planks so that the concrete does not go into waste and all the places can be covered. While we are casting concrete don't forget to use the concrete vibrator so that the concrete can be mixed well and no honeycombing occurs. Whenever you are constructing the drainage and box culvert, make sure that you carry out the proper alignment so that later on you do not have to break the box culvert. The end to end height of this box culvert is 0.55 meters while the weight is 0.8 meters. It depends on the topography and the volume of water which is going to be discharged through the culvert so as such you can design accordingly guys i hope you like this video still if you have any questions or comments you may write in the comment box you can also contact me once again thank you so much for watching this video until my next video goodbye